Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be updating my A5 binders. So I've got my Hal binder, my Lido binder and my One Us wide binder. Um, so as you can see, I've got lots of photo cards here. I've got five Minghaos at the top and then I've got some Lido album photo cards. I've actually finished my Lido album wishlist just in time for their new comeback. Then I've got Lido POBs and then I've got a lot of OT6 Malice and other sets. All right, so this is my Minghao binder. I have shown it previously, and I have five photo cards to store away today. So for Minghao, I basically just collect whatever photo cards I find really cute. And this has become um, more and more of my favorite way of storing photo cards and collecting photo cards. I love how um, every single photo card in this collection is something that I absolutely love. So, and these are all um, photo cards that I got for a really good price. So these three, I actually claimed in a bid sale and they were free, just pay shipping, which is incredible because I love his hairstyle. This is from Hitori Janai and it's the HMV photo cards. So I've got two of them. Then this is a Carrotland trading card and it's also the selfie glittery one so I am amazed that I was able to get this for free. <laughs> Got a Face of Sun carrot version photo card and then this one is the Seasons Greetings 2023 photo card. So yes these are the five that I'm going to store away for Mingha today. Let's open up the binder. I will also say that recently he has been so popular and so difficult to collect um because i opened a eju group order for uh for their new comeback fml and like wow the minghao slots got claimed so quickly i was so amazed all right so i'm gonna need another two sleeves and i think we will just um continue in like chronological order of how i got them Alrighty, so I am going to store away, I think I will store away these four since they're all the same hair colour and then I'll store him by himself. Okay, let's do it like this, maybe like this. Okay, so that is one page complete, and then for the next page, the same thing, just up here. Alrighty, so that is a little update of my Minghao binder. Nothing too amazing, but uh, yeah, just continuing on collecting the photo cards that I really, really like. So moving on, we are going to do the Lido binder. For the Lido binder, I have a lot of photo cards. Alrighty, so moving on to my Lido binder. For my Lido binder, I'm going to show you guys all the photo cards I have. Um, and I think what we're going to do is we're going to do it in chronological order. We're going to do all of the album photo cards first, and then we're going to do the POBs and the miscellaneous photo cards that I have. Right, so these are the Korean album photo cards. Put these aside for now. Okay, um, and then I will actually flip to the correct page and I'll show you the photo card before I put them inside. So I think I'll be able to fill in all of these spaces today. So first space we have is Fly With Us and we have this Fly With Us photo card. So this is what it looks like. The front and the back and he will go here so that is one page done and that is everything complete up to this page moving on to the next page so we've got uh, missing a lived photo card and two devil photo cards and I also have both of them so this is the lived one 
and he will go here. And then for the two devil photo cards, I also have them. Joined a group order for these and they arrived recently. So that is what they look like, black devil and green devil. Um, let's put them away. Alrighty, so up to devil, it is all finished now as well. So that is that page. Very nice. Then we can move on to Blood Moon. So for Blood Moon, I think I'm only missing one. I bought this from my friend as well. She came to Sydney and she hand delivered this to me. So that's very, very good. This is the Blood Moon photo card that I'm missing. And he, oh, whoops. And he will go here. All right, so that is Blood Moon all done as well. Very, very satisfying to fill in all of these spaces. Um, okay, and then moving on to Trickster. So these are the two Digipack photo cards for Trickster, and I do have both of them as well. Um, I tried getting these for really, really cheap because Trickster is not really my favorite era in terms of hairstyle, this funny lime green hair. But I did get both of these and just to complete the album photo cards. Alrighty, so let's store these away. Okay, and that is, yeah, as I said, that is actually uh, all of the album photo cards complete and Malice was complete since quite a while ago. And yep, so that is album photo cards complete. And then next comeback they have is Pygmalion or Pygmalion, I think. Um, and that will be next month, which is really, really exciting. I'm gonna just collect album photo cards for that. Not too many POVs. I've got um, like a bunch of POVs from Malice still. I think what we'll actually store away as well, um, since there's like two pockets here, I did also buy from Neocure these two dopamine photo cards. Um, so dopamine was their Japanese comeback. Uh, it was after Malice. And the backs are pretty plain, but I really like uh, the styling for dopamine. So just going to put them here. All right. So yeah, and also I don't think I will be collecting too many Japanese photo cards like very, very seriously. Just if I really like them, um, they will go here. All right, and then flipping to the back where the Malice POBs are. So these are all the Malice POBs. And then I have a lot more uh, in this pile here. So I'm going to flip to the back. Um, okay, I'm going to put more sleeves here because uh, to continue on with the Malice POVs. All right, so three extra pages here. Um, so I will sort out which ones are Malice and which ones are not Malice. But these ones, okay. So these are all Malice Lido POVs. Definitely got too many, <laughs> but uh, anyways. So these two right here are from UGU. They are from my OT6 fan sign, and I'm super thankful that they finally arrived. Um, the funny thing with UGU this time is they actually sent me two different sets of POBs instead of just the corresponding set for my fan sign. Um, so they sent me like lucky draws plus fan sign POBs, which is okay. Um, luckily, my go joiners were fine and everyone got what they wanted. So then we have this uh, Dear My Muse POV, it's double-sided. We've got this bubblegum one, which I really, really like. It's very unique, this one. It's also Dear My Muse. We've got a Hanbok one. Dear My Muse as well. Then we've got this Christmas one. I really like Christmas photo cards for some reason. 
so I tend to keep like a lot of Christmas POVs got two more Christmas POVs um, and yeah so those are the POVs I'm gonna store away there's eight of them so I will just do it in order I think Okay, so that is the first page of POVs. Moving on to the next page. Next page, we are going to do these four. Okay, and that is the Christmas page done. Um, and then moving on, so I'm going to put some unit cards as well. So I got these two Lido Raven unit cards. This one was also from Malice. This one was uh, one of their Megstar Halloween POVs. And then this one is from Blood Moon. So I think what I'll do is I'll just put the two units together. And then the other two photo cards that I have as well are these ones. So these ones are from the Reach Us sorry reach for us uh they're from the reach for us world tour um i think they're photo cards from the md so yeah i really like this outfit on him with that big slit at the front and i also like him in glasses so that's these two as well Okay, um, and I think that's actually the end of my little Lido binder update. So I finished all of the album cards today and then stored away a lot more of the POBs. I'm really, really happy with how this binder is doing and I'm so excited for their latest comeback and I'm really interested in seeing how their sound has changed and also how they look and sound as a five member group. So yes, that is the end of my Lido binder. Now let's move to the One Us OT6 binder. Okay, last but not least, we have the OT6 binder. So I'll show you the photo cards that I have from that. So basically all of my UGU stuff came in. And so I've got these Harry Potter ones from Neokyo. It's very exciting, these two. And then the rest, I think, is all Malice OT6 sets. And I'm really lucky that I did a group order because I was able to complete pretty much all of the um, the Malice OT6 sets for the album. Um, so let's store away the Harry Potter ones first. They're really, really cute, these ones. Okay, so this is my Harry Potter collection. Let's put that up here. Um, so right now we have a Raven and a Huanu. Um, and I was really lucky to find these on Nyoko because I know these Harry Potter ones are so popular. And these, uh, I think these are the online ones. So I'm going to store these away. Okay, so two more from the Harry Potter set. And that is really, really exciting. So I just need a Soho and a Shion. They were also listed on Neo Cure, but for some reason all of them were sold out. So I don't know why they didn't take down the listing. But anyways, that is my Harry Potter collection update. And the backs are all the same as well, which is really, really nice. So moving on to more Malice. I think I will do... I might actually do it in order. So I do like album and then Poca and then Eden version and then POBs. So I need some more um, sleeves. All right, so I've all right, so I've put some more sleeves in, and so the first set that we're gonna do is uh, from the Malice main version. It is like a really dark looking set, 
and it is from the music video and I have a lot of good memories with Malice. I think that's why I am collecting OT6 for pretty much everything in Malice. Um, cause I became a lot closer to my friends after I got into One Us cause they also like One Us. And I don't know, they kind of just treated me like a little sister for this entire comeback cause I was still a baby to Moon. And it was a really nice comeback and I loved how they had so many wins on music shows. And I loved all the success that they got and all the recognition. So let's store away these six first. Alright, so that is the first Malice main version OT6 set. So they're all holding their wrist up to their face and doing the perfume um, dance move, which is a really iconic move from that era. So it looks really, really good. And that is the back. Alright, next set that we're going to do, and I think the next set I'm missing a Connie, but Connie should be arriving with some other photo cards that I have. The next set that we're going to do is also from the MV and this is kind of like their individual concepts from the MV and they've got their signatures on the back. So yeah, these are from their solo shoots, I remember. So we've got Raven, Soho, Lido, Hanum and Xion got five and I'm missing a Connie so he will be coming later but let's store away these ones for now So that is the second OT6 set. Not quite complete, but Connie is arriving, so should be complete soon. Moving on to the next set, and I think the next set is also from the main version. And similar, I also have uh, five photo cards only. I have a Xion on the way, but for now, this is Raven. And these are the AR cards. So you download this app on your phone, and then when you scan this card, there will be a little, tiny little uh, full body One Us member that pops up on the card and it's really, really cute. It's also a bit weird and um, I spent a lot of time at the beginning of this comeback trying to make the AR glitch. So I had like a face down guy on my desk um, instead of standing up on the photo card and things like that. But that was really, really fun. So yes. That's these five. I will store them away. All right, so that is that set for now. Missing a Xion who is arriving soon. And then, last but not least, and I'm actually still considering whether I actually want to try and finish this set. So I have these two Polaroids, uh, Polaroid style photo cards. They are from the limited version. Um, and so far I have uh, Raven and Soho, and then I have a couple of Lido's, but they're in his own binder. So I'm thinking whether I want to buy more limited versions and try and get these photo cards or whether I want to leave it. So if it's too difficult, I might stop collecting OT6. Um, but for now, I do want to store the Hyung line or the two oldest guys away. And then we'll see how we go in collecting the rest of the OT6. If we don't, um, I might give up on this set. But yeah, let's store these two away. And they are really, really pretty.
Okay, I actually just went and checked another one of my tiny little collect books and I keep um, like miscellaneous Huanung Xion Raven things in this collect book and I actually found that I also have the Huanung and the Xion Polars so now that I have four, or I have five technically with Lido in his own binder um, I have five out of six Polars and I just need the Connie one um, so I actually should be able to finish this set pretty easily then so let's store away the two youngest guys. Yeah, I totally forgot about the fact that I had another collect book with random photo cards in it. So I have four. Um, and I should be able to actually finish this set pretty easily then. Because I only need a Connie and I might move a Lido or I might get another Lido. Alright, so that is how the Polar photo card set is going. And that is actually the end of this photo card storing video. I'm going to turn to my favorite set, which will be this set. Um, so yes, that is the end of this photo card storing video today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.